Hi folks, this is Adrian with my today's truck attempt on Store Tusha, which is uh, apparently here. I got to the level of uh, coal here, but not exactly. Due to the snow storm that I encountered on this face, it was, it was some quite brutal winds. Almost like uh, felt like a hurricane force. Uh, about here, I realized I forgot my eye socks. I didn't go back. I had crampons, and here uh, some young fellows with shovels were digging for avalanche test, and it kind of distracted me. Instead of going this way, I went follow some ski tracks here, and I ended up in the wrong third. And slowly I went my way up, but it was a bit uh, worrisome, the heavy danger, but I went uh, down where it was no steep, and then I started going up here, like I said, uh, during storm, and uh, yeah, by the time uh, I got here, it was uh, getting dark, I had to descend with two headlamps, and was uh, luckily I had a ski mask. So uh, why does it rotate? Here? Yeah, parking needs on a shoulder. This is a motor retusha, and this is store mountain. For good, good reason, it's called Storm Mountain. Highway uh, 40 Star uh, South, beyond the Winter Gates. Yeah. Please watch the 10 minutes video. It's little. What is called uh, Aretusha? This is a uh, Highwood Ridge, and I am uh, downhill from Highwood Pass. You can see already the cirque. Look how deep the snow is. I'm wearing snowshoes, but it's a really good trail. Dozens of people have snowshoes or skied here. This past few weeks, including today. I see some folks going up. Are little Aretusha? Actually, coming down. I started to snow a little. It was snowing uh, just a drizzle previously, but now uh, 
it's quite, you know, if it continues like this, it can actually add up to the snow. Track's still good, but uh, somehow it feels less. Oh, here's some skills. Less beat on trucks than before. Skills. Skills are just departing. And another group on uh, Little Retusha. I'm in a wrong circle. I thought I seen some trucks. There are no trucks here, but uh, maybe from before. Maybe just some animal trucks. And here uh, looks like there was some point release. Small avalanche. Uh, maybe from a fallen rock. Yeah, I'll head back and uh, try to see if I can merge uh, the other trail heading for Storetusha. It's kind of, I guess, where those trees are, on the right from it. So I came from that direction where I went uh, on a circle on left. When I uh, got there, I went lower, much lower. I followed some ski tracks, but not, not quite. Uh, I was kind of avoiding the steep terrain because uh, that's uh, avi prone, where it's more flat. Under 30 degrees, it's uh, safe, I should say much safer, but uh, yeah, now uh, as you can see it's snowing quite heavily, elevation is about 2400 meters high in the mountains, uh, my route goes to the right. And uh, with this fresh snow, even the avi danger uh, is increasing. I will take a decision uh, not long from now what, how to continue or give up altogether. I came from uh, a 
around right here on the left. It's uh, quite quite interesting uh, my detour for today. I simply didn't look at the GPS truck and uh, I was supposed to go that way. Instead, I went uh, the opposite way. So I'll see uh, how far I can get. My eye socks, uh, it's in my truck. At 250 meters, I from the track I remembered, uh, I left it in the truck, but I said I wouldn't bother to to go back. I got crampons. At this point I am gonna put my crampons on remove snowshoes lots of I get some views, but I believe that's a summit.